Good morning, I'm Kathleen Pate and this is my Alabama farm life. My project for today is trying to get everything out of the greenhouse. It's getting really hot in here. Uh, we're getting temperatures in the 80s and the 90s and if you come in here during the day, it's over 100 degrees. So <laughs> this next video is going to be me getting it cleaned out. This is the Mary Washington variety of asparagus that I started from seed. It took them forever to germinate, but the wait was well worth it. And now it's time to get them into the ground. I decided to do a different way of fertilizing. I'm still gonna use the 13, 13, 13, but I noticed that it gets a little liquidy when you leave it out. So I'm gonna go ahead and just mix this, what was left in this container, into my buck of water. Mix it up real good, let it sit for a while, and this is what I'm gonna use. I am gonna add more water to this bucket so it's less concentrated. The asparagus that I grew last year looks really good, but I need to go ahead and fill in the blank spaces or the empty spaces with these new asparagus seedlings that I have grown from seed. I just finished watching a video by Sherry from Gardening in the North. Her most recent video is how to plant asparagus in a container. So here's another option for asparagus planting. I'm going to go ahead and leave the link. So go see Sherry if you want to learn how to plant asparagus in the containers. And I'm not going to hold it against her that she's on Team Aquarius. Go Team Will It Grow! Oh my goodness. As you can see, I've got flies flying around me. I've got my asparagus finished. I have two bags of topsoil. I'll probably come out here another time and put the topsoil on them to make this a little bit deeper because I think it's just too shallow. And next, I'm going to get out here in a little while when it cools down and see what I could do about replacing these dead blueberries with the ones I have in the greenhouse. In between all the things that I'd like to do today, I have to weed eat. First, I'm gonna weed eat around all these blueberries. And if you look behind me, you can see my mother-in-law and her brother in the background, they are planting peas. After I finished weed eating, I could get a really good look at these plants that I had back here. I thought that all but one had died, but once I got back here and started looking at this last little plant that I had, I noticed that it had little leaves growing on it. So two survived, so I only need to replace three. Well, the rain chased me inside, so I decided to do a mail call. Good morning. I'm going to do another mail call. This is really awesome. I had a package waiting for me when I got home the other day, which was just, like I said, awesome. I won another giveaway from Bonnie's Bargains. And she does give some of the best giveaways. I'm going to, I was going to show the big thing first, but I'm going to do that last. I just want to show you a few things that she put in the bag that came with it. She sent me some dish towels, some little matching dish towels in a pretty blue pattern. I also got this 14 piece hair bands, the scrunchies, and those will come in handy because, you know, I have hair. And she also included some more Burt's Bees. I absolutely love the Burt's Bees. 
and I think I have enough to last me for a while, if not a lifetime. And this is kind of cool because she sent me these little cupcake markers and they're for happy birthday. And as a matter of fact, as I'm filming this, today is my birthday. I can't tell you how old I am, but some of you already know, and the others you can just guess. And then I also got another mask. It's a hydrating and collagen, and I can use as much collagen as I can get. She also included this really nice note. It has a little puppy on it, which is really adorable. And she tells me thank you. Also, her stickers, the stickers that she sends are absolutely adorable. And, and Bonnie, thank you, thank you so much. And uh, now for the big prize, which I was really excited about, but this is called Vivo, and it came in this really nice box. And it's empty, because I've already pulled it out. But this is a cell renewing night cream. It's in this really beautiful container and I've already popped this open but isn't that cool put the lid back on it but it's part of the white collection and it's supposed to be a rejuvenating cream cell renewing night cream it's got all kinds of rich ingredients to help you look younger and goodness knows I need as much help as I can get. I'm going to go ahead and do a reverse mail call. Um, I just did a giveaway and I've got my $25 gift card that I'm fixing to send and that's going to go to Blue Collar Homestead. They're going to be my first winners. I have a nice little card that I'm going to send them and their gift card and tell them again, congratulations for winning. And I'm going to get that in the mail today. So look for it. They are the winners of the video home for my first trip to Florida garden and greenhouse update. And I'm going to put a link up here in the corner if you want to go back and watch it. I've also just completed my second giveaway, and that's going to be Shed Wars 2021, my entry mail call and giveaway. And I'm going to be the, announcing the winner for that one at the end of the video. In the meantime, I'm going to go ahead and do another giveaway on this video. This is going to be a really easy contest. About eight months ago, I made a video where I purchased a t-shirt from Sawyer Ridge Farm. I'm going to link it up here and it's also going to be in the description. For this contest, all you have to do is go to that video, watch it, leave a comment telling me what you thought about the video. Whether you liked it or not, was it cute, you know, whatever. I'm going to do it in honor of the prior Oklahoma meetup that I just went to and also as a thank you to make aware of Sawyer Ridge Farm if you don't already know about them, about how wonderful they are and how much work they put into making the Oklahoma meetup work. The deadline for this video is going to be June 5th at midnight, so Saturday night at midnight. Again, the rules are very simple. You have to be a subscriber, you have to like, and you have to leave a comment. You have to be 18 years of age, or if you're younger, if you have an adult that's willing to accept the prize in your name, I will send it to you. The prize is a $25 gift card. I can use PayPal, Venmo, any cash app that you would like, or I can actually mail you a gift card in the amount of $25. It's however you prefer to receive your prize. So good luck. And now I'm going to announce the winner of my latest giveaway.
This is so awesome. The winner is Simple Southern Reflections. Thelma, I'm going to be sending you an email. I am just so happy that you won. This is awesome. Before the rain chased me inside, I was out here at the greenhouse pulling out these blueberry plants that I have in these five gallon pots and getting them ready to put out into the field to replace the ones that died. I think I did pretty good today. I've got a lot of weed eating done. We actually, while I was working on the blueberries, Eleanor and her brother were in the field. They were planting beans and they also put in a row of watermelon. So that's gonna be great to have all that come up. It's getting late and I don't think I'm going to get anything else accomplished today. Everything's wet and you can still hear the water dripping off the trees. So you guys have a great day.